Genesis chapter 2, verses 19 through 20. Now the Lord God had formed out of the ground all the wild animals and all the birds in the sky. He brought them to the man to see what he would name them. But for Adam, no suitable helper was found. What Adam learnt. Adam was created from the dust of the earth and had been commissioned by God to take care of the world. There's just one problem. He's all alone. The next big event in this story is the creation of Eve. But before that occurs, we should pause to observe a crucial aspect of God's character. Notice that God is aware of Adam's loneliness, even before Adam senses it. Yet God assigns him the colossal task of naming all the animals instead of addressing his loneliness. Worse still, each animal arrives with a companion, making Adam further aware of his loneliness. Why did God do that? Eternal salvation through Jesus Christ. No one believe. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. John 3.16 Number 2. Confess. If we confess our sins, he is faithful and just, and will forgive us our sins and purify us from all unrighteousness. 1 John 1.9 Number 3. Repent. Peter replied, Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, for the forgiveness of your sins, and you will receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. Acts 2.38 Number 4. Baptism Jesus replied, Very truly I tell you, no one can see the kingdom of God unless they are born again. John 3.3 3.